When working from a print, SmartCam has a set of innovative tools that can be used to create, manipulate and edit toolpath and wireframe geometry. We can see for example that we would perhaps start this profile at X 10.7, Y 55.5, got a line to X 92, we've got a line that's tangent to this arc, um, got another line at minus 90, minus 29 and so on. So <clears throat> if we start in SmartCam we'll use um, SmartCam's profile command to create that, uh, that profile. So I start off by creating um, these couple of lines and we'll visit this drawing um, as we progress around the shape. So um, <clears throat> a line from 10.7 Y55, X92 Y110 and then we'll come back and look at this drawing. So in SmartCam we're on um, we're associated with a with a SmartCam stepper cutter so we're drawing toolpath but we could just as well be drawing uh, wireframe layer geometry. So we create a smart cam profile. We'll start our profile at our X 10.7 Y 55.5. That's the beginning of, of our profile. And then we have that line that is going to X 92 Y 110. Back to the drawing. The next line um, we don't know its endpoint. Uh, the, the nature of SmartCam's profile command is that you can leave geometry items unresolved until they can become resolved by future conditions. So, what do we know about this line? We know that it's tangent to an arc at radius 30, the center is at 159 and 107. So, back to SmartCam. We've got a line that we know nothing about, so we can um, advance to the next item which is the arc known radius 30 center is at 159 107 we know it's a clockwise arc and again we don't know where the endpoint is do we so because it becomes tangent to our line at minus uh, 99 minus 29 degrees so I press on. I won't describe all of the steps that I'm doing, but I'm just using the same technique around the whole profile. We've speeded up the screen action a little bit here because the techniques we're using are the same that you've already seen. The SmartCam Profile command is just one geometry tool, but it can be used to create combinations of lines and arcs that are tangential and intersecting with each other. We come to one condition soon. There's an 80mm radius that can be in two positions because of the tangency conditions we're using and we'll see how we handle that in SmartCam. There's our 80mm radius so now we'll resume normal speed. There's another arc which is still tangent its center is at 0, zero 30 radius clockwise and SmartCam has detected that there are multiple solutions for that. So if we look at the possibilities, we can see the two arcs that meet that condition. Uh, both of that arc is tangent to both of those, the line and the arc I'm constructing. So we just give it a bit of help and accept the one condition. And the final item we want, again we don't know the end of this arc, the final item then is a line, still tangent to it, and simply the end point we just snap to where we started. The last thing to do then is to just blend with a 15 radius blend between there and there. We've just drawn toolpath in SmartCam but we could just as easily have been drawing wireframe line arc data. Perhaps the last thing to do is to add a lead in lead out to our profile. We'll add a radial lead in 15mm radius through 45 degrees, lead out the same, go, and finally we'll show path the tool path that we've just created. Keep it fairly slow.
As you appreciate from uh, previous parts of the demonstration, SmartCam has a great level of flexibility. We accept that some people might prefer to use um, unbound geometry and start to create using construction techniques as they might do on a drawing board. So here's the same geometry comprised of a series of disjointed lines and arcs. And we can quite simply um, <coughs> pick up all the items and clip them. So we can just start trimming out the elements that we don't need. Let's do that very quickly around this shape. <coughs> just trim all the lines first for no particular reason. Trim the arcs out. those tails. So that was a quick look at just some of the SmartCam geometry tools and you can see that we can create, edit and manipulate toolpath just as easy as we can wireframe geometry.